Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Ms. Roxanne and this is Daily Rambles. Today we're doing Supergirl at Season 1, Episode 2, called Stronger Together. So we're gonna start off with Supergirl training, and then there's a fire at the port. Basically, um, it's near an old um, barge. Yeah. And so, um, basically she tries to move it, and she does an epic fail. She does manage to move it, but she rips a whole a hole in the hull and oil drops out and um, it's not pretty for her and then we have Maxwell Lord's intro and criticizes Supergirl then Cat Grant is furious and wants an interview then Kara laughs it off but covers it up and then we cut to where James gives James gives Kara a pet talk and then we see an alien at a plant, and he also a security guard or a worker or someone. And then we have a flashback uh, talk with uh, Kara's mom about the creature when the Dia wants to know what kind of creature it was. And then we have cerebral training again with Alex, but they use kryptonite, um, I guess, lights. It's like, I guess it's emitting. Um, tonight through the lighting or something so anyway it lowers her strength so it's more if it even fights so cars begin to get the point of like yeah you're strong but you got to know your point your opponent's move and use that against them so she's trying to train her and cars starting to get the point for that and then Kara is actually pretty sore the next day then Kara talks to Kat about the articles like if you were Talk, talking to Supergirl through me, what would you tell her? And she says, um, well, basically Kat would tell her to basically slow down and clean up your image and do a better job. And then, um, we cut to where James and Wins know that they know that Kara is Supergirl. And then we cut to, um, then we cut to one of the generals, talks to the bad guy. Then Kara works um, her way up by doing like small crimes like um, and small stuff like basically rescuing snakes from a tree which is, <laughs> I don't know why that kid needed it fluffy but it did. Um, doing like robberies, like helping officers, doing fires, putting out fires, you know well, smaller stuff like that, you know, and building up her reputation. And then we cut to where Alex apologizes to Kara, and then turns out they find out that the alien uses DET to eat, and so that's why he's around these plants, these um, plants that produce DET. And then we cut to where Alex, um, not Alex, Cat wants James to do. Um, use his connections to get interview with Supergirl and if he doesn't do it within 24 hours he's fired then we cut to the Dio you lures out the alien and he man he actually takes Alex then Kara says she will do the interview to um, James because they have a little talk and she said well, she'll do the interview um, not because James told her it's because he didn't tell her and she heard from Kat that he's going to get fired if he doesn't do that. So she wants to help him out. Then we cut to Supergirl, um, searches for Alex, then finds her, then Astra shows up and uh, to save them. Then Kara's in shock. This basically Astra looks like her mother. Turns out that they were twins and Astra is not a nice person really. So it's Astra versus Supergirl. And then Alex manages to uh, off the alien. Then the DEO comes in and helps out. And then um, basically Alex basically stabs Astro with a kryptonite knife. And then we find out that then she then Astro flies away. And then Alex built a base for Supergirl. And then Kara talks to her mom's hologram in there. And then Henshaw um, is walking in and it turns out he has red eyes. I don't know why I said it's so country like that. I'm sorry. <laughs> then we cut to where Asher knows about Kryptonite now. And then Kat interviews Supergirl. And that's the end of the episode. Um, this was a better episode. I'll probably give this an A. It was pretty good. I actually thoroughly enjoyed it. And you can, see, 
you learn more about the aliens and like the flashbacks and all that type of stuff. I really did enjoy that. So, um, I think that's going to do it for this video. I'm just going to keep it simple because most people have already seen it. But I really like the image. And one thing I love about the show is the imagery and the uh, cinematography is really on point with the show. It's really, really, really gr good. I really, really like it. So anyway, that's a, that's going to do it for this video. If I get any more tongue tied, oh my god. Anyway, just leave a like, comment down below, tell me what you think, and then subscribe to me, please. And I'll see y'all next video, and I want y'all have a super awesome day. Bye, everybody. Yeah, we got better and not being tongue tied, my God.